So Jackie is coming into the fold when discussing the beauty community that she is part of and she is shading a lot of people or just in general and I definitely agree with what she is saying. To see a shift in the community, I would just love to see a little bit more authenticity. I'm seeing a lot of like Black Lives Matter statements from people who don't actually care about Black Lives like outside of a hashtag like how how do you put that into action hey guys it's Marad Morali hopefully you guys are doing well today if you haven't already click that button for daily and consistent hourly and consistent content head over to my Instagram guys subscribe to the channel and let's just quickly get into this video because I know everybody is busy and we don't have time to waste people's time so let's just get straight into this and keep it going so Jackie Aina of course if you don't know her then you need to get to know her she is a you know beauty influencer especially in the US which is where she's from and she is discussing during a, a get you know get ready with me um video and really just shading a lot of people when it comes to performative activism black lives matter is not just simply posting a hashtag i'm tired of people saying you know to beauty influencers oh, well what does that have to do like if somebody calls that out they'll say well that has nothing to do with black lives matter then you don't know what black lives matter means then. and where you're saying these hashtags or you're you know you're saying what everybody's saying or you're recycling pictures or black square or you know just a trend in general but there's nothing really behind it it's just all surface related there's nothing deep around do you know what i mean there's nothing more to it or you're doing it for the sake of not being dragged online and this kind of does relate to Jeffree Star for example his video I don't think she did this um, after his video I feel like this was pre-filmed um, but I feel like what she's saying can apply for him as well because his video his apology video or whatever the hell that was was absolutely pathetic um, I feel like it didn't make any sense um, and I genuinely feel like it was a very poor excuse but she's saying a lot of stuff as well and also you know just because she's photographed people like Kim K doesn't mean that she's friends with them they're just at events you so many people I think have really showed their true authentic colors because I'm just seeing a lot of people who were so quick to like get on their platforms and like do enough to like not get dragged for not talking about the obvious issues but like 365 days a year you're not doing the work to actually prove that Black Lives Matter see you know XYZ and and that she's just kind of over a, a lot of people in the beauty community who say a lot of stuff, they talk the talk, but they don't walk the walk. And again, I can see where she's coming from because it doesn't go that deep because the gag is people don't know how to go that deep because the majority of these influencers are white influencers and they don't know how to because they've never experienced or needed to because they wallow in their own privilege. Don't know what else to say about that there, but that's how I feel about that there. You're probably gonna see me doing a lot less codes this year. I've actually kind of slowly stopped promoting some of my codes here and there. I mean, I've also stopped uploading, so. <laughs> Oops, sorry. I they don't understand and they don't want to. Why would they want to and, and like they don't feel the need to do so, but they will all only do it just for image, 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 image. And then when this trend now dies for them, which probably already has, they won't be doing it. So she was saying, if you're not doing it three to five days a year, if you're not doing it continuously or haven't done so before, doing it now for a moment or a trend definitely comes off fishy. And it really shows your authentic self as a human being, as a person. And I feel like these are very good points that she's making. She is showing the whole beauty community, just not even just the beauty community, influencers in general, content creators in general, people who have a platform online, but don't really be doing as much. Let me know your thoughts on when it comes to this, because I'm here for it. I'm here for it. just, it's just, you know, people alert me about it, so I'll check it out. Um, subscribe to the channel, guys, and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.